Okay, if you're like me, you're going to want to discover everything that you need to craft your lifestyle. Well, the Craftbox, girl, Craftbox Girls can help you with everything from food to fashion to creating your own individual style, even outside of the home. And joining me now is Lynn Lilly, and you are the Chief Executive Officer yes. of Craftbox Girls. So tell me about your company, because this is a really cool thing. Everybody loves getting in on a DIY. Absolutely. DIY is so popular right now. So Craftbox Girls is a website for everything creative, just like you said. Things for your home that you can make, fashion, health and fitness. We even have recipes on there. Go on there if you want ideas for your child's birthday or to have a graduation party or even just to host a dinner party. So tons of ideas for everyone. So you, you literally knock out the entire lifestyle realm. Of Absolutely. Everything. So, so what are we getting into today? Because I see the red, white, and blue. That yes. is one thing. Brave. It's baseball <laughs> season, <laughs> right? So it's time to deck out our house for baseball season. So today we are going to be making a brave yard flag and this is no sew so it's super easy oh, right don't have to have a sewing machine we're gonna make it in a few easy steps so let's, let's get started let's do it one thing that I like about this all the girls even the guys are getting into mm -hmm. the whole country rustic Absolutely. Thing. So this is perfect for that. Burlap is our backdrop for okay. it. We took about 40 inches of burlap and we folded it in half. I went ahead and pre-glued it because we're a little short on time. That's perfect. But you leave about one Just to two tab. inches at the top so that you can put this on your flagpole. There you go. All right. Got to get it out there waving. Show so, your pride. Exactly. So we're going to start with a square of chevron. Mm -hmm. I'm going to have you use the hot glue gun and go ahead and put some hot glue around okay. the edges now, for it. Do you prefer dots or maybe a straight line? You know, a straight line. Okay. There you I go. Love and it doesn't guns. have to be perfect. That's the thing about crafting and DIYs. If your lines are a little crooked. So just along the side, should I also do the bottom and top? Yep. Just a tad. All right. There we you're go. a pro Getting at this. I can there. tell that you're crafty. There we go. Thank you. I do love All that. All right. So let's go ahead and flip it over. Okay. We're going to go ahead and position it in the center. And, and it, with chevron, it, it doesn't matter which way you have it turned, to be nope. honest with the... It's all about your things. preference. That's the thing about creating it. It's whatever you want to do. It's art. So now, to get the logo, mm -hmm. what we did is we found a logo online. And if you go to craftboxgirls.com, we've got the link to where you can get any logo you want for any sports team. You make it easy for us. Print it out. You're going to flip awesome. it over on a piece of fabric. And mm -hmm. you can trace it with chalk or Sharpie, whatever works best for you. And then you're going to cut out your logo. It, you follow the line, so anybody can honestly do this. I very, love it. very okay. simple. So, so again, Braves logo. Yep, we're going to be using the hot glue. So just kind of hit the hot spots on there. You don't have to make it perfect. Absolutely. And you know, hot glue is like a lifesaver. You may think, gosh, I have to have a sewing machine and this is so difficult. Oh, no, ma'am. <laughs> no, no, no. All right. So what we're going to do is go ahead and position that. And then just kind of push it down a little bit, of course, before the glue dries. Yep. I'm going to let you glue our tomahawk. All right. Got to get that chop going. Yep. All right. So we're going to get it along the handle. And of course, have to get this end of it too. And again, we go. you know, some people may think, how am I going to cut this out? You know, we've got the stencils for you on craftboxgirls.com. We make it super easy. Just kind of off to the side, just as their yep. logo looks. Yep. All right. Looks. So now we want to add a little bit of decor to the sides of it. So we took blue fabric, mm -hmm. just cut out strips of it. Oh, perfect. I see. And then you could just hot glue it. Yep. So we're going to hot glue our strips around the edges. So I'm going to go ahead and put some hot glue. Oh, right I see. And then here. you could actually just fold it around if the piece is a little bit too long. Yep. So you don't have to cut to size, per se. And you want to line these edges up, but we're going to do something with rickrack so that you don't even see the edges. And this, and the rickrack is kind of an old school style that I still very much love. You'll see it on little aprons. It looks really Absolutely. cutesy. All right. So let's go ahead and do this pretty quickly. We're just going to stick this on the sides here. Yeah. And you know, again, you can use ribbon. You don't have to use fabric. I had extra fabric after cutting out the logo and I didn't want it to go to waste. So I thought, instead of going and spending more money on ribbon, why not use my extra pieces? There you go. Kind All of right. So now go ahead and take your hot glue gun and add a line right there. Okay. Let's and see. then we'll, we'll put our rick rack quick. down. But look how quickly we're getting this done. We're doing this there in like go. four minutes. Bam. So it's super easy. And then once you have all the pieces cut out and ready to go, it seriously takes less yep. than 10 minutes, like you just said. I love that. And then this is the end product. We were Absolutely. just showing you guys this a second ago. And of course, you can get your little broomstick or whatever you need, hang it outside. I love this. Isn't Perfect for tailgating. You, you name it, you can take do this it with you. For any sports team, the Hawks, the Falcons, decorate your house. All these easy projects. Support your team, guys. Get out there. For more information, all you have to do is visit craftboxgirls.com.